If you keep playing bad on your first game of ranked, then here's 5 tasks you can do to warm up in Valorant. Today's video will be showing a quick and easy warm up routine you can do to make sure that you are fully ready when queuing for ranked. This video will feature 5 tasks which will warm up everything such as movement, flicks, cross air placement and more. The first thing you want to go do is shoot bots in the range. This is just to get a quick feel for your mouse movements. I also like to use jet knives and strafe left to right while killing bots which warms up my tracking. I will do this at short and long ranges to practice different micro adjustments. I tend to do this until I feel comfortable on the mouse and then I will begin to play the eliminate 50 game mode and practice counter strafing on these bots. This will help you get used to counter strafing and learn the timings of each shot. Keep in mind the main focus is to get used to the movements of your mouse because if you don't warm up properly your aim feels weird and everything just doesn't feel right. If you are struggling to counter strafe or don't know what it is then you can watch my quick 2 minute guide on how to do it in the description down below. Next you need to play the bots in medium and hard difficulty. I start with medium first to ensure I have accurate and precise flicks. Then move on to hard difficulty, which I mostly spray and try to kill as many as possible. This helps your ability to quickly flick onto a target and still maintain precise aim. I only do each difficulty once and also if you're golden below then I would recommend doing easy to medium. Now you need to change to sage and select the practice mode in the range. Then you can use her walls to create a peak so you can only see the bot's head. This helps practice micro adjustments and moving onto smaller targets. I only do this until the sage wall breaks which is around 45 seconds. Now you need to go through the teleporter and play the spike defusal game mode. This should be done on hard difficulty and this mainly focuses on crosshair placement and jiggle peaks. You should always be peaking like this instead of like this as you're only peeking one angle at a time when clearing a site. Doing this in your warm up is especially good as it will build muscle memory which will make it more likely for you to do this in a real game. After you have finished the spike defusal task you can go through and try complete the planting task on hard difficulty. This task is the one I use the most as you have to clear the site first and then hold it. I usually play a couple of these and try win with different weapons. Finally I hop into a deathmatch so I have a bit more practice shooting real players which is good for learning how people move and how to track them. In deathmatches you want to be crouch spraying as little as possible and you should be focusing on counter strafing and going for them headshots. Now you should be fully warmed up for your Valorant games. If you want to learn how to improve your audio in just 2 minutes then click here. Apart from that spin your boy critical. Peace out.